So just the other day, Kevin Ballister called me, sent me a message and said, let's talk. So I said, okay. I was like, what's going on, baby cakes? And so we ended up talking for about two hours and he recorded it. So I presume that it'll be a video that's available at some point. But we just talked totally spontaneously and um, he ultimately wanted the conversation to be about empowerment. I was like, I was like, I don't do that new age stuff. That's a joke. But I was describing the problems that I see. I don't even know how we got on that topic really, but I set out the problems like this. The, the global problem, literally speaking, the global problem right now is that everybody's acting like slaves. And so I defined five components to our current global slavery. The five components to our global slavery are, uh, as it stands right now in 2020, number one, most people are ignorant about what a viral infection is. Number two, because they're ignorant about viral infections, they are, by definition, therefore, also ignorant of the treatments for viral infections. So, for example, to have an intelligent, detailed conversation about a viral infection, you would at least need to know something about the structure and physiology of the initiation and consequences of a viral infection. So those four components are acquisition of the virus, replication of the virus, number three, the immune response, and number four, the systemic consequences. Ignorance about treating viral infections, uh, I think is very common even among, among medical doctors. But let's frame a really quick outline of how to treat viral infections in terms of vitamin D, which has obviously gotten lots of news lately. So step number one is acquisition of the virus. Vitamin D helps there by strengthening barriers, such as the production of um, antimicrobial peptides, as well as just strengthening epithelial and mucosal barriers. Step number two, replication of the virus. Vitamin D helps there as well by inhibiting NF-kappa B, for example, which is part of the pathway for viral replication. Step number three is immune response, which includes immune defense and anti-inflammatory kind of countermeasures, uh, including T regulatory cells, and vitamin D helps in both of those categories. And step number four are, include the systemic consequences of a viral infection. And again, vitamin D helps there with uh, limiting inflammation and also maintaining mitochondrial function. Step number three of our enslavery, or component number three, is the fact that nobody knows how to initiate or evaluate leadership. And that's why we are hosting uh, this international team of incompetent leaders. Step number four is that we have to define our relationship between ourselves and the state and what limits do we want to put on the powers of the state. And step number five of our global slavery right now is that we globally haven't defined the life, the lives that we want. And that's because we're told the lives that we should want. And that keeps us from developing an idea of the lives we really want. Um, and I think that's where philosophy comes in, and especially the work of Nietzsche. It just started raining on me right now. Uh, because Nietzsche's, a, a huge part of his philosophy was how can we improve life as we know it right now in this lifetime? Not waiting for some fantasy second life that may happen in the future or after we're dead or whatever. He said, how can, he said, that's worthless information. What are you going to do to make your life better now? What kind of life do you want to live now? No philosopher ever criticized as sweepingly as Nietzsche does, but no philosopher more strongly affirms this life in this world and the promise of humanity. So I invite you to review those five components of our global slavery 
and seek solutions to each one of those. Thank you very much, and this has been Dr. Vasquez. No philosopher ever criticized as sweepingly as Nietzsche does. But no philosopher more strongly affirms this life in this world and the promise of humanity.